finding your true purpose of life every living being has a purpose in life they have a motive that makes them present in the world finding your true purpose is what we'll help you do hi this is me jyotika bedi your host psychologist and the founder of happiness is love my main purpose in this podcast is to make you find your purpose what is your goal what is your motto and what do you really stand for this may sound a little boring and may go over your head but trust me finding your true purpose is like oxygen that we all need we all were born to do something in life and we at happiness is love are going to help you really find deep inside you that very purpose and your very need to exist your purpose in life is essential and we believe that we can find it together many of you must be wondering well what really is the importance of finding your purpose in life why do we really need it we are going to lay down some of them to reassure you that you really belong that you have a motto and that you really matter so again how the how to find your purpose in life because nobody teaches us there is no guide there's no manual as the youth of today you need to be well aware of what you want and ask yourself questions like what am i really good at dig deep and ask where does my passion lie do i need to enhance my capabilities if so how what makes me excited every single day what bores me every single day what can i do that will make me happier am i suitable for a certain role a lot of people and especially today's youth they ask us what we do about our free time how to keep ourselves busy so that we can learn and grow and evolve such questions are very very crucial so well to find your purpose you need to dig deep deeper actually i have struggled to find my purpose in life but then One day I woke up stared at the mirror and said to myself today I am going to be me today I am going to break free and do things that I enjoy and what I enjoy most is helping people and that's why as a psychologist I am in the profession of helping people finding your purpose is not easy it takes time devotion and commitment but when you do find your purpose your life will be at peace so what is the good thing about finding your purpose in life you might be thinking well to begin with you can be happy with your life you know how to keep yourself engaged meaningfully you can be okay with what you have you are content and satisfied with your life you view life from a positive lens When we talk about the purpose of our lives it's also about finding out what you want to be what is your passion and what you see yourself as in years to come it's very important to envision this mother i want to be a doctor when i grow up that's what a child said when he was younger but today this child is a photographer and doing very well the purpose of life may keep changing and may keep varying but remember you need to find your purpose in life and be okay with what life throws at you because life throws a curveball at all of us and we need to know that we need to embrace that some of the youngsters today have many questions regarding what the purpose of their life is and we bring to you some things that might help you know your purpose better what are these things i would love to share with you look into the things that you love doing take suggestions 
from family, from friends, from your parents. Read and research before you decide the line you wish to take upon. Take your time. Don't rush into things because everyone has their own timelines. Believe in yourself and be motivated to do what is best for you. And I know this is sometimes hard. Remember, everything will eventually be okay and be okay to seek help. These are a few things that have helped me and I hope this podcast is making sense to you and that you are not alone. We all have to do the deep work. The next step after this for you is to commit, to motivate yourself and believe that you can and you will achieve whatever you have set out to do, whatever is your goal, because the more you believe in yourself, the more you are going to achieve. And the final step is to know where your life is taking you. What is happiness to you and how can you achieve it? There are various paths. One is the easy one and the other one is the hard one, the difficult one. To be honest, many people that I know usually take the easy route. But if you're motivated enough, if you're consistent enough to do something and become someone people look upon, to then take the, then I suggest, then you'll be ready to take the difficult part because that's the most rewarding part. At the end of the day, it's really our choice. It's our journey to find the purpose of our lives. So thank you so much for listening. I hope that this podcast had stirred something in you and that you had a good time listening, just like I love sharing with you. Remember again, we all have a purpose. We just need to find it. Keep smiling, keep shining, keep inspiring and stay tuned for more.